Hello, so uh, I woke up this morning and uh, I checked Cartoon Brew and they had an article about this free storyboarding program which pretty much looks like a free alternative to Toon Boom. And it, it's, it is totally free, totally open source. All I had to do was give them my email. Um, I've already been figuring it out as I go along. Um, there were a few things that I was confused by as I started, so uh, I'm just going to demonstrate like how to just get started. So uh, you hit create new storyboard, pretty straightforward. Uh, you can actually do a script uh, or blank, but we're just going to do blank because I don't have a script. So uh, I clicked HD, it gives you a couple different ratios, but um, what I did, is, uh, what you want to do is make a new folder that's going to be uh, whatever your storyboard is. So I'll just just call this demo. Okay, so you got your folder demo, and then here you're actually going to type in the name. So I'm just going to call it demo also. And then uh, you hit create. But it's very important you give it some sort of name because if you just hit create, it won't work. So create, it loads. Woo! And, uh, and this is pretty much it. Uh, you'll get a wonderful motivational quote in the corner for some reason, but um, then there's all the tools. Uh, if you double click anything, it uh, it seems to just describe whatever it is. Um, so it's, I mean, that's pretty straightforward. Uh, one thing that was kind of a bit confusing at first was um, I was trying to figure out how to change the duration. The default is uh, two seconds. But uh, here, let me just draw something quick. I don't know. I'm not very fast as a digital artist, but whatever. Okay, so here's like a cartoon head. Okay, and we'll give him eyes and a smiley face. So that is creepy as hell. All right, so there, you got your beautiful creepy, um, creepy board. And uh, if you want to change the duration, you have to do it in milliseconds. So if you double click, it lovingly explains to you that uh, one second is a thousand milliseconds. So if you want it to be five seconds long, you just do 5,000. And it also tells you the frame, uh, how many frames that is. So that's pretty cool, but um, click enter. And there you go, you got a five second frame. Um, there's also, uh, if you just click and drag down here, a lot of different um, options, uh, which um, I will be exploring later. But I mean, that's the basic rundown. Um, they have a couple of drawing guides in here too. Uh, I think the coolest part of this whole thing though is that um, they have uh, they have this ability to export to Photoshop to clean up the frames. So, I mean, you can work really rough in this program and then just clean it up in Photoshop. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's totally free. Honestly, I'm pretty sure you could probably even use this to animate as long as you uh, time it well enough. But um, I don't know. I guess we'll, we'll see as we go along. I'm probably going to use this a bit and start working on my digital drawing because I really need to. But, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, I forgot my keyboard's in the way. So, yeah, there we go. There's the five seconds. I should have paid attention to that. So you can see if I change it to 2,000, it changes to two. So, yeah, that's, that's basically it. Um, and, I mean, I think that's enough to get started. You know, add new boards. Pretty straightforward, pretty awesome. And it doesn't cost $500, so... That's the absolute best part. All right, just thought you guys should know.